Sometimes you get bored of doing what you love. Today I'm going to cover 9 GTA 6 YouTubers who may be quitting GTA. Welcome back to GTA Robot, let's get into the video. Number 9, Dom is Live. The GTA YouTuber community rose after the release of the latest version of the game. While some people started streaming just to entertain people and some chose this road to make money out of it, Whatever the reason is, Dom is Live was one of the most growing channels on YouTube with over 100,000 subscribers and that too in over one year. He got GTA 6 before it even released, which brought huge traffic onto his channel as he showed cool stunts and tricks in his videos. The reason why he decided to stop playing GTA anymore is that he got his channel suspended several times which took all of his hard work down in vain. The YouTuber still uploads videos on his channel related to gaming and news but no longer plays GTA 6. Guys in front of me, get the heck out the way! Right, let's Yo, go. I am loving this race right now. Good job, Slow down, mate. Man. Number 8, I Crazy Teddy. Teddy got his claim to fame in the beginning with GTA 6 glitches and mods. This YouTuber has had more than 1 million subscribers on his channel at the moment. He was recognized due to his gaming skills, amazing stunts, and humorous commentary. The YouTuber was on the peak of his career when he decided to quit GTA 6, even though he still uploads videos on other games. There is no particular reason why he would quit GTA, but sources suggest that his kind of channel went downhill as he did not focus on it lately. You're about to get destroyed, mate. You're about to get- Oh! Yes! Stump! I'm on the ground, I take it! Number 7, 2Dynamic. 2Dynamic channels blew up with the audience when he started covering informational videos on GTA 6. You would get a professional vibe whenever you visit the channel. However, at the beginning of 2017, things started to slow down for him, and as of June 2017, he has not uploaded any single video on his channel related to GTA or any other channel. His channel currently has more than 600,000 subscribers on the list, which advocates his popularity. But fans are still in shock and dismay. Why would he take such a decision? Guy coming in front of him, but instead he ends up hitting the car that just flew over him. And Number 6, Sir Weed. The YouTuber was famous for GTA 6 glitches and mods through which he made headlines all around the world. The YouTuber has gotten more than 200,000 subscribers on his channel. He has decided to quit GTA 6 because his channel got deleted and hacked several times. He felt disheartened and even after recovering his account, he did not post any video on it. The YouTuber last uploaded a video on his channel around 4 years ago, which clearly states that he has no intention of coming back. <laughs> Number 5, Hike the Gamer. This guy has over 900,000 subscribers on his channel and was about to hit a tag of 1 million. However, he disappeared and didn't come back again. He was renowned for his funny GTA videos, where he used to perform cool stunts and tricks. His channel was going downhill since summer 2015, as his videos were not performing well. He decided to quit his channel and stop streaming GTA on it. Nobody still has a clue why he took such a huge step, but various sources suggest that he got busy with other things and couldn't focus on his channel. <laughs> like dude, this up. entity, man, just sucks on off-road, dude. Or this education. Number 4, Louis Calibre. Joined YouTube in 2009, the YouTuber soon got his place in the GTA community thanks to his entertaining and humorous videos. Louis Calibre has more than 5 million subscribers on his channel, which advocates his popularity. There is no clear explanation of why he left his fans hanging around in the wild out there and quit uploading content on the channel. <laughs> Who's talking? We, we, we need to kill that guy. Number 3, Red Kimon. The famous YouTuber with over 1 million subscribers on the channel went out of the screen suddenly 5 years ago. He joined YouTube in 2013 and received immense popularity from the fans due to his funny and entertaining content before he decided to quit the channel. His most noticeable video got more than 100 million views on the channel, which was a huge milestone for him at that time. Red Keymon was one of those channels that used to show cool stunts, short films, and other things related to GTA. However, he left the people in shock when his channel became inactive suddenly and there was no activity around. That's just wrong. Number 2, Sernando. This famous YouTuber personality started streaming GTA 6 on his channel, but soon quit it. Have you ever thought about why he would take such a step? Even though he has got a huge fan following around the world, Sernando has over 6 million subscribers on his channel at the moment, which itself is an appreciation for him. It was reported that Sernando used clickbaits in his GTA 6 videos and made false claims which violated the code of conduct of YouTube. As a result, the management of YouTube removed his accounts twice. Sernando then decided to quit streaming GTA and started focusing on other games. Since the video got watched by a bunch of you guys. Number 1, Mr. James Geary. Before the release of GTA 6, Mr. James Geary used to stream Call of Duty on his channel. He got famous because of his unique style of commentary and narration in the videos. Before he started streaming GTA 6, Mr. James Geary had 30,000 subscribers on his channel. However, after featuring GTA 6 on his channel, he rose to new heights and received huge popularity around the world with over 400,000 subscribers on the channel. 
However, Mr. James Geary stopped uploading videos on his channel suddenly, which amazed the fans. There is no particular reason for this and why he took such a step. Many of the news reported that he had some of his reasons, which is why he is not active anymore. Should do. I mean, I have no plans for the whole day, so I want to get some fun stuff going with you guys. I apologize, but it's another Xbox lobby. Trust me, I'm working on getting a PS3. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.